Hello, welcome back. Steel Pennings here once again. And today I have a special little treat. I have this lock that I got. It is a little four pin Medco cam cylinder. And he had no key for it. And uh, I said, let me see what I can do. So I pulled off the cap. And all the pins are in there. And I dug around my bin and I found a key that was similar. As long as I cut the bottom of it and wall it out the wardings. And you hear the, my kids in there. I'm not going to get on them about them trying to film because I'm happy they're getting along. <laughs> Teenagers. So I got it to fit the lock. So we're good and golden there. We have a key that fits in the lock. But of course we, the, the, those pins don't fit that bidding. So let's dump them out. And I have gone through my little pen kit here. This is a gorgeous uh, 65 or 60 series full step pen kit. So I took here. These are the old springs. And I just flung one. I hate fucking with springs. These are the new ones. And with that, I have the new um, pins ready to rock and roll as well. So let's uh, pop them in there. And you'll see here, this is how they, they work, really. They have a hole on each side that the cylinder in the sidebar fits into, along with uh, two uh, serrations. And you can see which side it would be on. That one's a left step. The other side would be a right step. And the center would be a center. And on top here you'll see this barb. That keeps it's a limiter. Keeps it from turning too much. There we go. So we'll take that. Drop it down in here. And move to the next one. And drop it down in here. This one. And this one. There we go. And give them all a push down so they set. And Lo and behold, it works the lock. So, yeah, yeah, works it. Yeah. So we'll take the springs. Let's zoom out a bit. Take the springs here. What? Pop them right. Flop them so they jump out and jump around. It was sit there. Once you get them all, son of a bitch. I have no idea what the hell they're doing in there. And then I took this one and I cut it down to fit this particular lock let's see if we can get it on there now if I can hold it correctly push it down on there like that it seems to be working the lock alright so Go from there. Holding it down. Grabbing my large. Little hammer. Of course, you know, because you're wanting it to work with you.
Is that like the dinner bell? And that there will help get it started. And that way you can turn it sideways. Give it a little bit of a whack to it. I can't do it in front of the camera, guys. I'm sorry. Give me a half a second. you've done that you can whack it down on there a little bit harder and now it's on there I think I want to take the tip down a little bit more simply because it, was, it is sticking up and I don't want it to be it up and we see that of course the sidebar isn't going to work until the key is inserted and there it goes a little crunchy at first let's see put in the housing uh, Hang on, let me tap this down a little better. Dirty SOBs, right? It's like, come on already. Okay, I guess we can hope for the best there. Put it back in. It seems like that last pin doesn't want to actuate. Half the sidebar is wanting to work, the other half isn't. The old key of wacky wacky. <laughs> Finally, I get it to turn. Now I just got to get it the rest of the way in there, right? I'll work on that and come back. So from my children and their arguing now to everything else, I've got it now working with the key. In and out of their housing. And that's all you can ask for, right? We'll put a end on it and see if he wants it back or if I should add it to the collection of Camlocks. I'll sign off there. Sorry for the interruptions and all the banter. Y'all please stay safe and always stay legit. If you like this video and like what I do here, hit that like button. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. And as always, until we meet again, peace.